Hi everyone, this is Jennifer and I'm back today with a new layout made with the Keeping It Real collection by Pink Fresh Studio. To begin, I cut the world girl several times with the help of my big shot and the other alpha dye set by Pink Fresh. I love this alphabet which allows you to use letter in different ways. The possibilities are endless and it's great. I then coded a white cardstock with clear gesso to add the inks, but first I glued the words girl directly on my page. This will create a raised background that I really like to make. So I only use the outline of the letters that I glue by making three lines on each side of the page in the center. I don't start with a whole word to give the effect of a cut and more destructured background. When everything is well glued, I apply gesso over the letters with a large brush in circular movements to spread the gesso well all over and around the letters. Next, I use the Anemone Magic Washi that I glue on a white cardstock. Then with the Anemone Magic Dye set, I cut the outline of the flower patterns with my big chop. I do this several times to have lots of flowers. Me who loves to include flowers of my pages, with this collection of watchy uh, which is just amazing i'm really happy so i will help me with these flowers to determine the background color of my page So, for the bagroom, I start with Lindy's salt water taffy ink that I apply in the center of my page by making a circle. Thank you. 
I dry everything to fix the color and I add in this sweet violet purple teal ink which perfectly matches the color of one of the washi flowers. I apply the ink and enlarge the area by applying ink to the letters so that they stand out. I dry again and add more ink to darken a few areas. I dry and stopping there for the moment doing some ton and ton ink splatters. I will resume the work of inks after having arranged my photos and some flowers for a better visual. So I prepare my photos which I stack with crumpled tracing paper only and pieces of cardboard to add volume and I glue the photos in the center of my page. I continue with the decoration which will be mainly flowery. I cut all the small flowers from the collection floral pattern paper that I will alternate with the washi flowers. I also cut the flowers in washi to have only the flowers that interest me for this layout. I create flower clusters around my photos. With the alphabet from the collection, I uh, create the phrases My Sweet Girl and You Are Just and add the words Awesome and Today from the puffy phrases from the collection. I add three different under a few flowers to add volume and create shading.
I then glue all the flowers around my photos only. I made these clusters with the same flowers by arranging them in a mirror for a more harmonious visual. So I continue with the inks and I create a color gradient by widening the ink area. I darken the color near the photos and I lighten outwards which allows the photos to stand out even more. I love making gradients and with the background in relief, I find it superb. Once the gradient is finished, I finish gluing the rest of my decoration. I had a lot of trouble finding this collection like every Pink Fresh Studio collection. In France, it's complicated to find some brand and unfortunately Pink Fresh Studio is one of them. So, I'm late on the collection because there is already another one out, but I'm so happy to finally be able to use this one. I totally fell in love with these washi too. They are just gorgeous. I think I'll really have fun with them for a little while. Okay, we continue with my layouts. So for the photos, I printed the same photo simply mirrored. I love this photo so much that I wanted it in two copies and I really like this mirror effect. I continue to glue all the elements of my layouts.
I finish this layout with splashes of golden ink to harmonize the whole. It's a Jen Hatfield uh, spray ink, but I believe it's uh, sold out. I hope this layout inspired you for a future project. I loved making it and finally being able to use this collection and there's washi which are just perfect. Thanks for stopping by and watching. I wish you a wonderful day full of creativity. See you soon. Mm -hmm.